Hi guys. It's been a while, I know. Firstly, I'm just going to go over a few things. I've never done this before as in a pre-recorded voice message or video. There's so many things. Um, I know I've been away and it's it's just been something I can't describe. It's been triggering in so many ways. But firstly, I want to give a very, very big shout out and thank you to Kraken Cases. Firstly, to Ali for the support, love and encouragement you give to Cam with everything he deals with on a daily basis. I think you are both amazing. I'm an SA survivor also. And to see a young man dealing with the same sort of issues and how he had to protect his brother, which I also had to do with my little sister. Just on so many levels, I really um, had a shift in the way I think about things. And Cam, you are so brave, so strong, Never doubt that, and please don't let the negative, ridiculous haters get to you like they have to me. It's hard, like, it's so hard. I never thought it would be this hard, but I've let people down. Miss Justice, I am so sorry to all my subs, um, my silence is not gratitude to you guys for being here for me every day and I apologise that I shut down emotionally and it gets me to a point where I just block stuff out and I had an email this morning that really shook me into oh my god I'm hurting the people that care about me and it's a genuine care like I just appreciate it so much. Like, you guys have no idea how things... <laughs> I know you probably have um, experienced anxiety and that sort of stuff, but when you've got people coming at you every single time you open your mouth, it's daunting and horrible and... I just can't deal with it, but I go into other people's chats and try to support other creators and it comes across like I'm ghosting my own family and I am so sorry for that, but participating in other chats and still being involved as a sub, it takes your mind off your own brain, if that makes sense. Um, I don't know how to put it into words because I can't understand how my brain works to begin with. I've said it so many times that 
I'll get really, really anxious just to hit that live button. And it's so true. Like even now, I'm pre-recording this little video. I don't even know if I'll get to a point to upload it, but I'm hoping I do. If I'm not rambling, it's so different just sitting here talking and not having the chat to interact with. But I will do a live a little bit later this afternoon. But I honestly need to have a nap or I will fall asleep. I've been awake all night. Um, Australian time, waiting for the verdict. Oh, actually, firstly, I was... Um, watching Ernie, which also set me off again, because we're going through exactly the same thing that I'm watching Ernie do with these psychotic breaks. I've spoken about it before, even though um, a certain creator feels that Creators shouldn't speak about their private life unless it directly pertains to the Summer Wells case. I think that is total BS, especially from this certain creator that does nothing but that. So again, the hypocrisy is real. Um, I'm probably being hypocritical because I'm speaking about it, but it is what it is. Um, it's scary. We, on a daily basis, are getting voice messages, text messages, everything from her, and her mindset is exactly the same as Ernie's when he's on these little scary episodes. So I'd, we do not know what to do. I apologize, the dogs are being crazy. He he's, thinks he's a, a bird again. He's trying to catch the birds. Your devil. Um, yeah, it, it's just a lot. But, again, keep your head up, Cam. Don't listen to anybody about any of the accusations or their negative um, attitudes. They're just not worth it. Honestly, they try to bring us down over and over and over with their conspiracy theories and their threats and accusations, trying to turn people against us. But okay. yeah, I've had a big awakening. So I just wanted to come on and say, I'm sorry. I am going to do better and be back into my lives. And there's a case I shared um, on my community post last night. I only come across it last night um, of Tani Shanks. We're going to go over that um, story this afternoon after I have a little nap. So if you want to go to my community wall and watch the 60 minutes story I shared, <clears throat> please, please do. And if anyone um, has a community tab that they can share it, please, can you share it? It's so important that um, little Adeline gets her mum back and her Australian family gets some answers. It's really horrible, heart-wrenching. Um, I've reached out 
to one of Tani's brothers and the um, Bring Tani Shanks Home Facebook page, which I think her brother um, administers. So he's an administrator, creator of that group. Please share that out on Facebook if you can. I'll put that on the Down Under Crime Talks Facebook page. Um, the sub that um, my absence has affected, I'm not going to say who, I'm just going to say I treasure you, I value you, and I am so, so sorry that I wasn't there for you when you needed me. That's not who I am. And nothing I say can make it better. But please know you've made a difference to me today to see that no matter what I'm going through, we're all in this together. And I promise to do better and get back on the bandwagon, so to speak and be there for you guys. But I really do appreciate everyone. We'll do some show and tell this afternoon. I have been really busy with um, the quilting. I did a course, it was amazing. I learned heaps of new stuff. I nearly have, I've only got borders to put on Suzanne's quilt. Um, and there's a new fabric line out, oh my God. I might post some pictures of that range before I have a sleep that's um, come in at the local quilt shop. It's the new Tilda range called Chic something. I can't remember the name, but it is divine. And I know Brandy and Miss Justice are going to be in love with these fabrics. And I've got some quick machine quilts already planned for these fabrics. So I will talk to you guys this afternoon and we will go over some more stuff. But I'm back to stay this time, guys. Please believe me. Um, the birds are still chirping. You'll be <laughs> happy to know. And yeah, I will talk to you this afternoon. I'll schedule the live now. It'll probably be about 4 p.m. my time, and it's 10.15 now. I am. Um, so I don't know what time that's going to be. Four, five. Five and a half hours? I know, it's going to be really late. But I can't wait to talk to you guys in chat. And I'll see you then. Bye.